So here we have the vacuum itself. It's a bagged tools attached vacuum cleaner. You've got your variable height control for different heights of carpet, hard floors right up to long pile carpet. It's a bagged system and inside here is your dust bag. It's a fabric type bag and underneath there you've got your filter. That just clicks into place. It's a little bit tricky doing this with one hand. There we go, that's in. And above the bag door we've got your variable motor speed so you can lower the suction or increase it according to what you're cleaning. On the back of the machine, let's turn it round, you've got your cord storage here and to release the cord you simply turn down the top hook and the whole cord comes away like that. You've got your on off switch here which glows red when the machine's plugged in and it's covered in this splash proof material so if you your hands were damp if you were shampooing that just protects you from uh, any shocks but obviously it's best not to try and use the machine if you've got wet hands. On here is the spill pickup tool that's demonstrated in the other video that enables you to pick up some quick uh, spillages, small spillages using the hose that's built onto the cleaner. Um, the hose is here just pulls off and this hose as you'll see in the video looks quite short on this but it does actually reach very easily up your stairs because it stretches considerably more than its length. On board you've also got this which is a dusting tool, nice large dusting tool, soft brushes. That brush slides off or pushes off like that. So you've got your upholstery tool and there's also a little stiffer brush at the front there so that's good for your upholstery inside your car. And you've got your crevice tool here and you've got two extension tubes, one nests inside the other one. And that all fits on board like that. Oops. There we go. And pop the other nozzles back on. And then the hose, you've got also got a see-through elbow here in case it does become blocked you will see if it's blocked and this all comes away. There's a little release lever inside the bag compartment and you can pull the hose completely off in case you have a blockage. And the hose just stores neatly back on the cleaner. I'll be showing you in the other video how you set this up to use for carpet washing. It's fairly straightforward. Of course you do get the full instructions with this machine. And as we can see it's a 1400 watt motor. And there's a, a number there. I don't know if that number is still valid because of course Vax has changed considerably as a company since this vacuum cleaner was manufactured. Just show you the underside of the machine so you can see that it's it's basically spotlessly clean like I said it's only been used very briefly in the video so there we have your rotating brush this brush also as a safety feature when the machines in the upright position when you're using the cleaning tools or using it for carpet washing these brushes do remain stationary so they're not brushing your carpet so that's a, a nice little safety feature that this machine has. So there we have it, that's the VAX HF 1400 with all the tools. It will come in its original box. The box is a bit tatty because it had been stored for a long time in the shop's warehouse. But everything inside is, as you can see, completely mint. I'll add some extra packaging around the machine as well just to make sure you get it in one piece. It will be sent via a tract courier service or you may collect if you wish to, if you live locally to Halifax in West Yorkshire. To save a little bit of postage you can collect this machine and pay cash on delivery. If you have any further questions please click on the link in the auction. 
But don't forget, if you need to see this machine in action, as a normal vacuum cleaner, as a spill picker upper, using the tools and actually using it as a carpet washer, there is a more substantial, longer video underneath the link of this one.